Does an extra clean, germ-free environment better protect a child's health? Or does it actually make it easier for them to get sick? That is the question behind what is known as the hygiene hypothesis. What does it mean and does it have any scientific backing? King Fire's Christine Pay asks a local physician for some insight in this week's Health Link. The hygiene hypothesis is a theory that suggests exposing children to pathogens early in life could help them gain immunity from infectious diseases, even protect them from developing asthma and allergies as they grow older. So the hygiene hypothesis is an idea and it dates back more than 30 years now. That Dr. Joshua Liao is an internal medicine physician at UW Medicine. So the idea is that um, an adequate exposure to certain um, organisms early on um, can help children's immune systems. In our post-pandemic world, Dr. Liao says patients have brought this topic up. Um, particularly after COVID, when so much attention got paid to hand washing and social distancing and masking and the like and vaccinations, I just qualitatively, in my own experience, seeing people talk about this more. The hypothesis adds overly clean and germless environments may hinder a child's immune system from developing properly and might be a reason why asthma and allergies have risen in recent decades. The CDC reports one in four U.S. children had a seasonal allergy, eczema or food allergy in 2021. And Washington state has some of the highest asthma cases in the nation, with about 120,000 young people in Washington having asthma, according to data from the DOH. The numbers of individuals and children that have asthma and allergies is rising in developed country over time. That's not in dispute. The issue is more that whether we can link that hypothesis to it. Liao says there's no definitive answer and more research needs to be done. There is a connection if you look at the evidence around it. But to me, it's not ironclad that it's related to the hypothesis leading to asthma and allergies. Liao adds, not all exposure to germs is bad and recommends parents should approach it with moderation. Uh, kids playing on the ground um, in public spaces. I think that's where you want to have hygiene uh, for any number of reasons. What you don't want to have happen is people say, well, I want to clean my breast before breastfeeding. I should wash my mouth before I kiss my children. Um, we're playing in a park and I need to hand sanitize, you know, every five, 10 minutes. And so I would think about it that way. For HealthLink, I'm Christine Pei. Don't forget, you can check out all of our previous HealthLink stories at King5.com. Just click on the HealthLink tab.